Good morning, you guys. Today is Wednesday the 16th. Let me double check. Yes, Wednesday, March 16th. It's been a couple of weeks since I vlogged, so I thought I'd pick up the camera today. I want to show you I finished the last stitch that I was working on, so I wanted to show you. Here it is, all stitched up. Isn't it beautiful? Um, this is the fabric that I got for the back of it. So now all I have to do is decide what I want to do with the hoop because I can't make up my mind. Um, so I got to decide what I want to do with the hoop and then wash this and iron it, which I'm hoping to do today. Um, and then it will be ready to get hooped as soon as I finish up with the hoop. Um, so that's how that's going. This project over here, I took it apart. But I have yet to, um, hold on, I have yet to frog the words and put in the new words, but I have taken it apart, <laughs> so it's kind of ready to go. Um, so that's where I'm at on these stitch projects. I will show you my current one here in a little bit. Um, yeah, we do not have much going on today. My mom is coming um, as usual on Wednesday, so she's coming by, and we, let's see, what else is going on today? Uh, Matthew has play rehearsal this evening, so he'll be late getting home today. It's his last rehearsal before his actual play, which is really stinking exciting. Are you excited? Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, my dog is going crazy. Cooper, it's okay, buddy. Um, so that's going on today, and we are doing school this morning here in a little while. So what'll happen is our typical routine is I take Matthew to school, we come back, Mikey has some free time to like play on our iPad or watch TV for a little while while I finish getting ready, and then I set up for pre-K, and then I talk to my husband for a few minutes, and then we do school. Um, and after school, we usually play something for a little while, or we go and run an errand. Today, after school, my mom should be here, so um, yeah. So that's what's going on. I just wanted to check in. Matthew, you got any words to say about your play? No. Nothing other than you're just really excited? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm excited to see him in a play. I'm really excited. So, um, all right. I am officially ready for the day. I also got pre-K set up. I'm going to show you what we're doing today. Um, but I got pre-K set up and I also washed one of the dog food bins. We have two dog food bins because we get really big bags of dog food. And I saw on TikTok that it was a the best thing that you could do is when you empty a dog food bin, you wash it. And we've never done that, so, which may be really horrible, but we've never done that. I never even crossed my mind. So, um, we had one that they emptied, that Matthew emptied out this morning. So I went ahead and washed it, got it put up. So got that done. So let me show you, let me show you what we have for pre-K today, what we're working on. It is St. Patrick's Day week. So we are doing rainbow and St. Patrick's Day themed things. So we've got this printable, which is just like a rainbow sort. And so all she's got to do is take the pom-poms out of here and put them on the right spot. So that's pretty simple. Then we've got rainbow pattern cards. So I give her a pattern card and she has to do the popsicle sticks just like the pattern card. Um, so there's all different kinds of patterns and things that she can do so we're gonna do those and then this is a pot like a you know like a pot of gold and she's gonna use her thumbprint to make the gold on it so that is what we have going on oh and also this worksheet I printed out she's gonna trace the letter P she gets to uh, draw a line from the circle to things that begin with the letter P she gets to cut these and glue them on whether it starts with a P or not. And then she has to find the lowercase P that goes with the uppercase P. So we are going to do this worksheet today. 
And that is everything that we are doing for preschool today. So very exciting stuff. So my mom is here. Um, they're playing with stuffies. I've got laundry going. I washed my stitch. I need to iron it next um, here in just a minute. But I got it washed. So that is a positive step. It's just hanging up, kind of drying up a little bit. But I'm going to wash it in just a minute. I mean iron it in just a minute and get all of the wrinkles out and then hang it back up. I also have to get my backer fabric and iron it um, because it's got some creases on it. Um, so that's kind of what's going on. My husband will be calling here in a few minutes and I'm going to have a cup of coffee because I am tired, y'all. Like, tired. And not that caffeine really does that much for me with my ADHD, but I need some coffee really bad. So for dinner tonight we are having meatballs and spaghetti and so I've got meatballs in the crock pot. Um, I have cleaned out some pre-k stuff and listed it for free. <sighs> Let me tell you that listing stuff to get rid of is the hardest thing and people just don't read what you post. So I clearly put in the message when I listed this item free uh, dry erase map and then <laughs> I put must meet in the next town over or pay for shipping free to whoever right <laughs> the first comment i get on it is price then i get people messaging me like oh well i can meet today i like i said i have to meet this weekend i can meet today or i can meet here or i can meet here and i'm like no it I clearly stated my stuff. Like, I clearly stated, um, hold on. Um, anyways, like, I clearly stated the parameters here, so either fall in the parameters or leave me alone. Um, 
<laughs> Anyways, it, it's free stuff. So it's like the least you can do is work with me here on all of the other things. Like, it's free. Um, but anyways, I am getting ready to have my second cup of coffee for the day. I have cross-stitched. I have cleaned stuff out. I have washed cross-stitches and ironed them. And I stained my hoop. I'll show you that in a second. Um, so it's just drying. Once it's dry, I can take it out and poly it so that it'll stay um, looking pretty. And yeah, I think that's it. I think that's all that's been going on. I'm tired today. Um, my knee is really hurting today. And my mom, <laughs> I love you, mom. I know you're watching. Uh, my mom ate an orange here. And if you don't know, I am really allergic to oranges. Like, even the smell of them, I'm allergic to. And I started having an allergic reaction. I'm fine. Um, hold on. So here's our dinner. I've okay. got... Butter toast, some mixed veggies, and meatballs and spaghetti. Um, yeah, it's really yummy, y'all. Really yummy. Okay, so I went and picked up the big kid. He's back there eating dinner. Picked him up from rehearsal, and we swung by Dollar General. Um, I had a couple of coupons that I needed to use up on some Airwick warmers, so I got this Airwick warmer, and this one. Um, I really didn't need any more, but I needed to use the coupons in order to use another coupon on Saturday. And I got both of those for pretty cheap. So anyways, um, I got those. Now I'm back home. I've clearly taken off my makeup for the day and I am getting ready to take a shower. Tomorrow is going to be kind of a crazy day because we have to leave early. Um, Matthew has to be at school earlier than we normally leave the house. So that's going to be fun. And he has to be like hair done, makeup done, ready to go. So, um, so yeah, it's going to be a little crazy in the morning and then, you know, usually Thursdays are crazy anyways because it's grocery day. So we will see how much I vlog in the morning, but I am done for tonight. So I will catch you guys. Good morning, you guys. It is, today is Thursday, <laughs> March 17th. It is St. Patrick's Day. I'm wearing my mint green shirt because I don't have a green green shirt. Um, so mint and green is just going to have to do the trick today. Um, I have already gotten up, gotten ready, gotten the kids ready, um, got Matthew ready for his play and got him out the door. So he is already at school getting ready for the play. Um, just blows my mind. My little kid, my baby. Um, if I will insert a picture here if he gives me permission to do so. Um, but if not, then just ignore that um <laughs> anyways today is grocery day so as soon as well at eight o'clock we are going to head out pick up groceries i'm going to drop mike off at school then i'm going to drop groceries off at my grandparents come home and drop groceries off here and then my goal is to work on my stitch um which i don't even think i've shown you guys um so i'll show you guys that but that is the plan for the day Real exciting stuff, I'm telling you, real exciting. <laughs> Okay, so it's about 12 o'clock. I have been having my hands in a million different projects. I've polyed my hoop. 
um, for one of my stitches. And then I've got laundry going. I cooked some ground turkey for tacos that I needed to get pre-cooked and then I've been stitching. So I'm going to show you the stitch that I am currently working on if I can get it laid out here. Okay, so this is the one I'm currently working on. It cracks me up. Um, <laughs> so now I have one more page and it's the flowers on this side. So I've got to get that going. Um, but yeah, this is what I've been doing. I've been doing 18 million different things and running around like a chicken with my head cut off and stitching. Um, I'm currently watching Chicago Med. Um, I'm way behind on it, so I'm catching up on it. And I'm going to have a snack and then get back to stitching. So I took a minute. I cleaned up in here, got everything put away. The table was a disaster. Mikey had all of this fake money everywhere. So I cleaned that up. I did the dishes. I emptied the dishwasher and reloaded it. Um, I'm running the dryer again because my bathroom rugs take forever to dry. They just absorb all the water and they don't dry. Um, I also did some work in my planner, wrote down some stuff that I know needs to get done over the next couple of weeks. And that's kind of where I'm at. It is, let's see what time it is. I have no idea. 12.37, I leave at 1.15. So I've got about 20-ish minutes to go clean up elsewhere. So I am going to go work on that. So I picked up a curbside order at Walgreens. I got this shea butter. Woo, that is out of focus. Coconut and hibiscus So Shea butter, shea moisture. Uh, and this shea moisture eczema therapy bar soap. And then two boxes of pads. Um, and then I also got in the mail my friend Jerry. I will link her Instagram down below. Um, sells Saint and so I ordered some Saint makeup from her and I got that in the mail today so pretty stinking excited um yeah that's it we're home I'm getting ready to make dinner I look crazy right now um so for dinner we had these mini donuts that were so stinking good um Jason and I bought a mini donut maker on clearance at Walmart last weekend and so I decided we always have breakfast for dinner on Thursdays and I decided I wanted to do something different than what we usually do and I was like perfect time to use the mini donut maker but if y'all don't know my husband is allergic to dairy and all of the recipes that were included in the book with the donut maker used buttermilk and so I was like, well, what do I do? So I decided to just whip up some pancake mix and put the pancake batter in the donut holes. And then when it came out, I dipped it in melted dairy-free butter and then into a cinnamon sugar mix. And holy cow, they were really yummy. Um, so it's actually much later though. Um, I think it's like almost six o'clock and I am currently doing nothing. No, I am getting ready to go around and shut all of the windows for the night and um, feed the cat that we have that hangs around our front yard. Um, like, we have a bunch of stray cats out here and so I put food out for them. And so I'm gonna do that and shut all the windows and that's pretty much it. Um, my husband thought he fixed this, but he did a really bad job fixing it. It's our screen window is broken. Anyways, that's a discussion for later. Anyways, I am going to go and shut all of these. Good morning, you guys. It's a little dark over here. There we go. There's not much sun out today because it's supposed to storm. So, um, anyways, I am, I've already taken Matthew to school for the day and all of that. I am ready for the day. Makeup, jewelry, clothes, all of that's done. Mikey is watching TV right now. I'm going to go set up for school and then talk to my husband for a few minutes. And then, um, we're going to do school and then we're going to run over to my grandparents and visit with them for a little bit. So that's the plans for the day. Okay, so for pre-K today, 
um, we're doing a handprint shamrock. Then I've got this sheet that's got letters on it, and then I have gold coins that also have letters on them, so she's going to pick out a gold coin. I've got a pot. I'm going to put these in. She's going to pull the gold coin out of the pot and put it where it goes. These are not in alphabetical order, so it makes it a little more difficult for her to find it. Then I've got these. They're little rainbows. They have a pipe cleaner on them, and she has to bead however many beads it says. So this says six, so she has to put six beads on the pipe cleaner. Um, and then we have this P worksheet. So that is what we are doing for pre-K today. Uh, hello. So we went to my grandparents for a few hours. Um, watched watched some Bugs Bunny and things like that. Well, I think she watched Tom and Jerry with my grandfather. That's her favorite thing to do, is to watch Bugs Bunny and Tom and Jerry, those kinds of old cartoons with my grandfather. She just loves it. Um, so we are back home now, and I really, I swapped the laundry over, so I've got clothes going in the dryer now. And I am just going to kind of tidy up. I've got, I went through our uh, St. Patrick's Day preschool stuff and pulled out what I wanted to keep and what I didn't. So I've got stuff like sitting around that just needs to be put up. And the file folder from last week needs to be put up and all of that stuff. So I just need to deal with a few little things that are hanging around here. And then I am going to do something. I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do. <laughs> We've only got a couple hours here before we have to leave and pick up Bub. So I'm just going to try to make the most of my time and get some tidying up done. desperate need of new kitchen chairs but they were really dirty so I went ahead and wiped them all down with a Lysol wipe but I'm going to show you why we need new ones like number one can you see all of the chips that are all over the chairs um number two this one is cracked right here and number three my husband cracked the seat on this one the other day so we are in desperate need of some new kitchen chairs um, but I don't know if we want to hold out. We don't use the kitchen table a ton. Um, so I'm thinking we might hold out a little longer until we decide to build the table and bench. Um, because the goal has always been to build a bench here and do a longer table. Um, and then have four chairs on this opposite side. So I don't know, what do you think? Do you think we should just hold out or do you think we should go ahead? You guys, it is, what is it? It's March, <laughs> it's March. Um, Matthew's birthday is in November. <laughs> and my big chalkboard still says, happy 12th birthday, bub. <laughs> I think it's time to get rid of the birthday message. Um, that way I can do something cool for Easter, which is coming up. Um, not that I'm an artist or anything by any stretch of the imagination, so it probably will look like crap, but at least I'm making an effort, right? So I'm going to take a minute and erase this and then wipe down the board and give it a good fresh start. in the oven 
cooking away for dinner. Um, Matthew has Matthew has another play performance tonight. So I've got to double check the time that he has to be back at the school for this performance. Um, but I'm pretty certain it's five. It's also supposed to storm tonight. So exciting. Um, I love spring. I don't love spring. Um, <laughs> but anyways, so dinner is going. I'm going to go double check the times for what time he has to be back at the school. And my husband is probably like 10 minutes, 15 minutes out from being home. So I'm finally going to get to see him. Look who's here. They can't see that. <laughs> Good for them. Right. <laughs> no, they've not seen you on this vlog at all. No, they haven't. I have evaded. Yeah. That's what happens when you work late one night and like ignore us the other night. No, I'm just <laughs> work late, yes. Dead to the world. <laughs> Everything's blooming and I am in death con. Yep. Yep, him and Mikey are, are feeling the allergy flow. Everybody keeps calling me COVID at work. It's like, we got tests to prove. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Go away. It's Move not me COVID. Alone. Don't get me kicked out for two weeks. Yeah. Not COVID, just allergies. So I know I showed this piece that I bought at Goodwill a vlog or two ago. Um, I finally just got all of the words ripped out and so now it's ready for me to sketch out where I'm putting the new words. I'm pretty excited. Okay, we are back home. The play was awesome. Matthew did. Matthew did. Incredible. Um, it was just really good. Um, if, if he will let me, I will insert a picture or two right here. Um, there's a chicken trying to peek around me over there. Um, but yeah, it was really good. Um, so that is it. I have been vlogging for three days now, so I am ready to, <laughs> yeah. Um, I am ready to end this vlog here because um, it is probably long enough. So, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. And we will catch you guys in the next one.